you know, it's it's eight years yeah. uh, to the month since Harvard was sued. Absolutely. It's been an unbelievable honor yeah. to be able to represent Harvard in this litigation. Absolutely. I feel like we tried a case and we had findings from the district judge that reflected what Harvard admissions is about, yeah. what Harvard College and Harvard University are about and yeah. what they value as institutions. Absolutely. I think the allegations that are have been thrown around in this case, even today, that Harvard engages in intentional discrimination of any sort against Asian Americans or yeah. otherwise is completely unfounded and despicable, right. unprofessional. But I'm very proud of what Harvard has done yeah. in the area of diversity and providing a genuinely wonderful, multi-varied experience. And it was a privilege to be able to defend it today. Any comment on what happened inside the, inside the building? Well, the notion that you know, the notion that the Supreme Court would hear five hours of oral Absolutely. argument on this, Absolutely. I think, indicates the seriousness with which the court is taking right. a request to take that, that it take a, yeah. a historically consequential <laughs> step. And I'm not one of the justices. Absolutely. I don't have a vote, but I'm very, very hopeful that they won't unravel the work, the good work that's been done in the past 45 years yeah, since Bakke. Thank Bakke's. you so much. Anything else you want to add? Um, go Harvard. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs>